Hey, it's Siri here. Welcome back to another video on my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be going, walking you through how to do Amazon affiliate marketing step by step. So this is going to be a full tutorial that's going to show you how you could do Amazon affiliate marketing. So if you are interested in doing Amazon affiliate marketing, definitely be sure to watch this video all the way to the end because I'm going to be showing you step by step how to do affiliate marketing on Amazon and actually make those commissions. So very excited to, of course, get into this. If, if this is the first time that you're on my channel, I'm always putting out new videos on a regular basis, Monday through Friday, that will show you how to do affiliate marketing, how to grow an online business, and how to create a passive income right from home. So if you enjoy videos like that, definitely be, definitely be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and also take that bell icon so you can be notified whenever there is a brand new video on this channel. So without further ado, let's get right into things. All right, so step number one is you want to set up a website or a YouTube channel in a very specific niche. Now, why do I recommend setting up a website or YouTube channel? This, I'd say, is really the way to go when it comes to promoting products off of Amazon. And the reason for this is because Amazon's uh, commission rates aren't really that high compared to a lot of other affiliate programs. So with the Amazon affiliate program, if I just scroll down here, it shows you could earn up to 10% in commissions whenever you refer a customer to Amazon to buy a product. Now, this is at the very max that you can get. Uh, usually, um, on average, you kind of get around 3 to 6% uh, of the commission rate. Um, so that for that reason, I would say free organic traffic is really the way to go. And I'd say the really the best way to do that is by setting up a website or a YouTube channel. So this is where you're, of course, creating content, you're creating, you know, reviews of, you know, certain products that you're, of course, testing out. And then anyone who searches up, you know, product name plus review, when they get on your uh, your channel or your website and they, you know, they watch your review, they could check out the product that you're, of course, recommending right there. So whenever someone, of course, clicks on your link and they buy the product, then you get paid a commission. So what you want to do is you want to set up a, either a website or a YouTube channel, and then you want to determine what niche that you're, of course, going to go into. So it could be anything from, you know, it could be gaming, it could be home and gardening, it can be health and fitness, it could be, you know, reviewing technology, it could be beauty products. There's a ton of different niches that you could, of course, go into. But what you want to do is you want to ideally pick something that you're, of course, passionate about, something that you're rather knowledgeable about, and then you could, of course, decide to start a YouTube channel or a website, or perhaps you could even start up both, but really I'd say one or the other is really the way to go. So, um, you know, I'll show you a few examples of a few YouTubers here. So uh, here's a uh, video review that I found of the Google Pixel 3a. So this is actually the phone that I have actually. And in his video's description, so here he pretty much, you know, reviews what the phone is all about there. And then in his description, he has a link to where you could, you know, anyone could of course click on this link, they go to Amazon and when they buy the product, then he, of course, gets paid a commission right there. So this is his own affiliate link right here. Uh, here's another example. This is a uh, review of like a mattress that I found. Uh, so this is the Zinus Green Tea Mattress. I've never really heard of this, but um, here's a link uh, that they have in their description. You know, anyone who clicks on that link, they go to Amazon and they decide to buy this product, they get paid a commission for that. So think of it like this, right? Uh, this channel only had to put up this video one time. So they put in the work, they created this, you know, eight minute, Eight minute video and it's getting thousands of views so imagine if you could put up one video or you know like you you know you build up a large enough following and you get lots of people watching your videos regularly you put up one video and that video could you know sell that product that you're of course reviewing for years to come so that's really the benefit with doing affiliate marketing is that over time it can really add up and you can definitely make a lot lots of money with it if you're of course willing to put in the work so here's uh some websites here we've got this site called Essential Home and Garden. They're reviewing like this uh, lawnmower and they have a link in here where you could of course go to Amazon and you could see what the price is on there. So this is their affiliate link that they have here. When a, a you know website visitor clicks on it, they buy the product, they of course get a, paid a commission. Same with this one right here. This is a review of like the uh, Roku um, TV. If this wants to, uh, let's see, this is an ad. I'm gonna close that. <laughs> So I'm going to close that there. And this is, of course, a review of the uh, Roku. I actually have one of these myself. Um, here's another food link. So, I mean, you kind of get the idea with this. So this is ideally what you want to be doing is you want to set up a website or a YouTube channel in a very specific uh, niche. So something that you're, of course, you know, passionate about. But then step number two is you want to start creating content about your about what you're interested in and then start reviewing products. So the way that I would recommend going about this is you ideally want to start with products that you already own. So products that you know you may have had you know have around the house like if you are going into like the niche of 
you know, technology or something, right? You like, you know, uh, laptops or smartphones. What you could do is you could maybe review, you know, the laptop that you currently have. You could review your uh, smartphone, you know, pretty much go over what it's all about. And then you can get, you know, kind of get in the feel for reviewing products. So you ideally want to, of course, start getting some experience before you decide to start testing out some other products. And this, I'd say, is really what you want to be focusing on for the most part. You want to be creating content on a consistent basis. So whether you're creating videos on YouTube or whether you're, you know, writing up uh, blog articles, you really want to be consistent with this. You want to, of course, be putting up content on a rather consistent basis. The more consistent you are with this, the more you're, of course, going to grow in the long term. So that's really the one thing that I just cannot stress enough. A lot of people, they think that if they uh, decide to dip their toes in the water and they put up one review that immediately they're going to become rich overnight. That's really not how it works. You do have to have a long term mindset with this. But as long as you're willing to, of course, put in the work, you could definitely make some pretty good money with the Amazon affiliate program right there. And then step number three is once you have, you know, some reviews out, then you could, of course, sign up to the Amazon affiliate program. Now, why did I put this as step number three rather than, you know, step number one? Well, in order to get approved for the Amazon Associates program, you need to have a website or a YouTube channel up um, where it has, you know, uh, content on there. You know, that's really the best way to ensure that you do get approved to the Amazon affiliate program because you have to, of course, apply to the program by clicking on this button and then they'll take you uh, through like a step by step phase. And in order to, of course, get approved, they need to see that you have a website with, you know, content or like a YouTube channel where you're, of course, putting up reviews. Um, they probably will review if per, will review your channel if you are, you know, completely brand new. But I'd say it's really best to, of course, you know, kind of get the feel of, you know, creating videos or creating, you know, blog posts. And then, you know, you kind of get some traction. And uh, the other reason why I recommend this is because in order to stay on the Amazon affiliate program, uh, you, do, you do need to make at least, I believe it's three sales within your first uh, six months on the platform. And if you don't, then they will kick you off the platform. Now, no big deal. You could always, just, you know, just sign back up, you know, whenever you want, and they should be able to allow you back in. But uh, they do kick you off the platform if they if you don't make sales within that uh, specific time right there. So that's what you, of course, want to do. And this step, I'd say, is pretty self-explanatory once you, of course, go through the process. It's really just, you know, fill in some basic information, you know, enter your uh, website or YouTube channel link, and then, you know, all the type of stuff right there. So that's step number three is you want to, of course, get signed up to the Amazon affiliate program. And then step number four is you want to include uh, links throughout your content. So throughout your uh, videos, or your blog posts, you want to include links to where any of your viewers or website visitors can decide to pick up the product yourself uh, themselves. So like, for example, you know, this uh, review that I was just showing you here, Google Pixel 3a review, he has a link in his description to where anyone who, uh, of course, clicks on this link, you know, they click on that, they it, uh, takes them over to Amazon, and they can decide to pick up the phone right here. So it costs about, you know, $418 right there at the moment for a brand new one. Uh, or you could probably get it, you know, used for a cheaper price. And then when, whenever someone buys this product through this link, then uh, this guy right here, Marquise Brownlee, I think is his uh, username, uh, he of course gets paid a commission for that. So uh, this video also has, you know, nearly, you know, 3 million views. And it's of course getting viewed, um, you know, lots of times throughout uh, each day. Look at this, 81 views per hour. Imagine getting that many views on one video that you of course put up and you've got, your, you know, your link down here. So. This guy's probably making lots of money through the Amazon affiliate program. So there is definitely a great earning potential if you could, of course, you know, be consistent with this. However, there is one downside to the Amazon affiliate program, and that is the commission rates are generally not that low. So in order to really make a full time income with the Amazon affiliate program, you need to be uh, making lots of volume on the platform. So you need to be making lots of sales because like, let's say that you're reviewing products that are like, you know, like a. Uh, like below 100 bucks, right? If you're getting paid commissions that that's like, you know, less than 10%, that's like less than a dollar commission. So it's like, you know, what, like 50 cent commissions or something like that, uh, which generally when you really think about it is really not that much. So that's kind of the only uh, issue that I have with the Amazon affiliate program. So uh, what do I recommend that you go for um, instead of Amazon affiliate marketing? Well, you could, definitely, you could definitely make a lots of money on the Amazon affiliate program, considering that you're, of course, willing to put in the work. However, if you are completely if you are completely brand new and you don't have like a massive following, if you don't have, you know, like a massive influence, and you, you don't want to, you know, take the time to, of course, build up this massive audience, then what I would personally recommend is you want to uh, go into a niche where there is a much bigger earning potential. You want to pick, um, 
you know, a different, a different affiliate program where they pay out much bigger commissions. Now, there's other affiliate programs such as ClickBank. They primarily have digital products. But uh, if you want to learn more about how you could do affiliate marketing, you know, as a full-time thing, if you want to learn how to create a full-time income with affiliate marketing and be able to earn big commissions, uh, as well as, you know, monthly recurring commissions from, you know, multiple streams of income, then my number one link down below this video will give you access to a free training that will show you how you could build in a profitable online business through the concept of affiliate marketing. So with this, you don't have to worry about, you know, getting, you know, small, small commissions. You don't have to worry about, you know, putting in lots of work into creating content. This will show you how you could build up a profitable business in the long term that will actually support you in the long term. So I'm very excited to, of course, share that with you. If, if you're interested in learning more about how to do affiliate marketing full time and you want to learn how to create an entire business around this concept, then you could definitely check out the first link down below and that will give you access to that free training. But anyways, hope you found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Give it a thumbs up because it really does help the channel. And anyways, take care.